Hi, my name is Rake and I've been playing FPS games for almost 14 years and I've had almost 20 mice in my entire gaming career. Today, I have with me the Fantech G10 which costs for only 4 dollars or 200 pesos. For those who aren't familiar with Fantech, it is a gaming company here that sells multiple peripherals for an affordable price. Here we have the mouse on my desk and my first impression of this mouse is that it has no side buttons which can be one of the causes why some people won't buy this. This is how the G10 Rasta looks like when you pair it side by side with my other mouse. As you can see, this is a small mouse that can fit majority of the player's hands. The G10 can be used for both left and right since the design is ambidextrous and it only weighs around 80 grams. The length and width for this mouse is around 4.6 inches and 2.5 inches, while the height for this mouse is 1.3 inches. As for the DPI, it has a 4 dedicated DPI button that can go up to 2600 DPI. Also, the cable for this mouse is already braided and so far is comfortable to move around without any mouse bungee. As for the shape of the mouse, it has a curved side so you can easily pick it up while the top part of the mouse is like a slope. The shape is suited for majority of the gamers but if you have bigger hands then try searching for other alternatives instead. As for testing, I will be using this mouse for my gameplay since I believe that the best way to test a mouse with a price like this is when you specially game on it. My final thoughts for this mouse. For four dollars, this is a good mouse. The G10 Rasta is best suited for casual gaming on a budget, especially for its shape and comfort. Just a tip of advice, though: get a mouse that suits your hand perfectly. And also, it is not the mouse that makes the player, but it's the player that makes the mouse look good. If you enjoyed the video. Please feel free to click the like button and subscribe if you want more content like this. See you next time.